Hello, YouTube. This is Alexander again, and today on the bench I have this soldering station, which is very really nice actually. Uh, after seeing it on the uh, YouTube and uh, finding it very interesting, I purchased one and uh, I try to share what I discover about this uh, station. And this is the reason why this uh, station is on my bench today. And uh, I will tell um, after seeing uh, the video of SG Electronic from Steve that this purpose is actually made to made to work with those kind of handle which are very little handle and not the 245 which is here. Despite the fact that this uh, handle is provided with the units, you cannot expect a full power of this kind of uh, handle because it's absolutely not designed to work with the, the electric connection which are here and uh, because you need to know that those kind of handle are made uh, for working on 12 volt, uh, mainly 12 volt alter alternative when uh, uh, they are supplied with um, uh, normally a classical transformer, whereas this one is made. Oh, okay, this one is made uh, for working on 24 volt. Okay, this is not the same power and the same impedance also. So, uh, first of all, I want to talk here about uh, the wiring of this unit. Uh, and uh, I think a lot of people thought it was uh, different uh, voltage from different different chip, but also this is absolutely not the case. Those wire are the wire connected to the uh, to the chip of the of the of the wire of the of the soldering iron through through the cable and they are not concerned by the the transformer output those wire here are thick and uh, they are the main supply for the soldering iron and those one which are blue are very little power and uh, they are if you can see on the pcb they are connected with um, a little bridge rectifier and the purpose of it is to supply the PCB and you can see very near from this after um, a, a bunch of uh, capacitors for filtering you can see a 5 volt regulator which is I think um, destined to supply a 5 volt uh, section and also maybe the LCD screen and uh, and so on. So. What I discover here is that this is a single voltage supply and it's uh, not designed for uh, all the kind of handle. Of course, if you, if you uh, decrease the power of something, you can use it, but not at the full tilt. But here you can uh, choose uh, to work properly. You can choose you can choose just those handle, those little handle, okay? And if you want to use properly uh, this uh, the big handle, you need to be uh, very humble and uh, not requesting all the power from those kind of tip because the voltage from this device is not designed to supply this handle. This is not the case of the 420 T420 which is here and uh, uh, is able to provide a very uh, high power to uh, the stand and uh, of course this one has not yet because I made some um, some tests. Okay. Actually you can see a clamp meter and uh, also on my left you can see uh, Variac and uh, with a this uh, different voltage we can see we will see that the power uh, increase or decrease uh, compare according to the voltage in entry and uh, also if you are a different voltage on entry of this transformer because this is a classical transformer which is not uh, switching power supply you will have a changing uh, voltage on the output on the secondary secondary okay 
So first, let's open, let's uh, switch on this uh, little clump meter and uh, see on this multimeter about the voltage. But for the moment, it's not switch on. Okay. This is the main supply for the soldering iron. And this is not this uh, brown wire is the supply for the soldering iron and the blue are for the PCB. If you confound them, you can have a very uh, strange behavior and uh, a miss of power li like it was on the SDG electronic uh, video. So here on the multimeter, you can see there is no voltage for the moment. And uh, I will just switch off, switch on, sorry. And with uh, this little uh, sponge, we will make the reaction to, to, to look about the power, okay? So let's switch on and see and see the power for regulating. Okay, you can see 4 amp until 4 amp for regulating this chip and you can see a voltage uh, about 13 volts alternative on this brown wire. And also, if you want to check uh, the, the intensity of the current uh, on the blue wire, it doesn't change because the blue wire is not, um, is not uh, made to drive the handle. It's, it's just uh, for the PCB. So here you can see uh, for 230, uh, 230 um, th volts, the power consumption and if you make the test you can see almost 60 watt 60 watt of power on the just this little tip okay i just redo the thing okay um i i need to uh, insist on that uh, that fact that the brown wire are, are, are just to support the handle and the blue wire are not involved on that on the uh, on the driving of the of the chip and um, so i will just make uh, another test with this little handle okay and see and see the power consumption the current consumption uh, con consumption the voltage drop Okay, now the 115 is connected and uh, the device is not uh, switched on. Uh, the temperature is about 318, 80. And uh, let's see, let's switch on, see the current and the voltage, okay? Okay, almost, almost two, uh, two amp or three amp and uh, uh, classical voltage about uh, 13 and you can see here the conception and look at the chip and the regulation okay you are, you are about 35 watt okay about 2 amp okay so now let's try Let's try the big, the big handle, okay? Let's try the big handle. Uh, the big handle is connected with my classical chip, uh, which I use on this, uh, usually on this one, but uh, I, I prefer to use this one because I'm sure it's a, a good chip. And um, let's see when connected, how it reacts about the clamp meter and the voltage, okay. Okay, about 3 amp only. Okay. Okay, about 12 volt because uh, there was a little bit uh, disconnected. So, uh, and uh, when it's rising, we can see about 45, 45 watts. And about the regulation. Why? Okay, because simply 
this device is not fed by 24 volts. Okay. What we need to understand about that is that this device, this unit is absolutely nice, but uh, it's made for driving the ki those kind of handle. This handle only itself is able to, to, to draw 4 amp when, uh, when hitting, okay? And uh, this one is uh, very little, about 3, 2 or 3 amp, and uh, that's all. The voltage you, ha you have here is made to drive those kind of tip, okay? If you want to buy this station and intending to use this handle, uh, maybe you need to choose the Exxon T320, uh, uh, I think, okay? Which uh, has a, a switching power supply on it. This one is absolutely not not made for those kind of, uh, of handle, even if absolutely you can work with it, you can solder, you can you, you can do what you want. You can you can you can do what you want, but you it's very nice. It's it, it works, but this is absolutely not the efficiency of this one, which is very powerful actually. Okay. Uh, I think that's all, and uh, of course, um, I use uh, this uh, uh, this uh, variac because I wanted to show that if I increase the output voltage, not too much, because if I increase the voltage too much, this this device this device will switch by protecting the output. So I will just put a little bit more, not too much. Okay, okay, 250, okay? And now let's try a new uh, a new test for the regulation, okay? Now see the voltage on the output of this uh, brown uh, wire and see how it reacts. Okay, now you have 60 watt, fully 60 watt with um, a voltage of uh, something like... Uh, 13 volt RMS because they are RMS voltage. But if you if I put this uh, on the wet sponge, look at the dropping voltage. Okay. But it's regulating very very fast. But you need for that you need to raise the voltage at this one, 250. So maybe I think that. This little transformer need to be rewinded, re maybe. Okay, but okay, I don't need uh, absolutely to work with uh, those uh, a perfect handle like that. Just um, this uh, power is uh, is absolutely enough for me. If I want more, I can take another station. This is absolutely not the problem. But you need to know that if you want the station, you need to expect that you, uh, you you are going to work very nicely with those handles. Okay, that's all for today. Um, I don't know exactly what I'm doing with uh, what I'm going to do with this uh, station. Maybe I will let it like that. It's not very important to, to have a miss of power. Um, so I hope you like this video uh, and tell you see you soon.